Hi, I've been asked to do a follow-up video on how to create a um, how to cut out a shape from the lattice. So here goes. Um, I'm going to select the ellipse tool and I'm going to make a circle in the middle of the lattice. Now if you hold down the shift key and the alt key you will get a circle that is restrained by the centre. But just to make sure that these are lined up, I'm going to select all and press centre to page and then I know that they are all lined up. Now I'm just going to zoom in on this. We have a circle, we need two more circles. So I'm going to make select the circle Come on! I'm not sure if it's selecting or not. Let me just zoom out to see if it's selected. I can't see. No, it's selecting the lattice. There we go. Got it. Alright, I'm going to zoom back in again. Tip. Select your way! I'm <laughs> getting a bit mad here. <laughs> Ah, oh, the joys of technology. Let's zoom back out again. Now it's going too far the other way. Oh my goodness. Right. One step at a time. Tip, don't click the zoom button too fast. Right, here we go. Now I want to make um, two more circles. So we go up to the offset window and I want to do an internal offset of one millimeter apply and I want to do another one of another millimeter apply now trying to select the inner circle is a bit tricky so I might have to zoom in again And select the inner circle. I'll just check that it is selected. Yep, there it is. Control Z will take you back to the spot where you started from and select the lattice. Now the reason we're doing this is we want to cut out the shape from the lattice but we need a little bit of an overlap in order to create the outer circle and the inner circle will become a frame. All will become clear in a moment. As clear as mud I think. Um, right, you want to go to the modified window and we want to subtract all. There we go, it's disappeared. But now you can see there's a little bit of an overlap on the lattice. Now we don't want that middle circle anymore, so we're going to delete that. Nope, it's deleted the lattice. Ta da! Control Z will bring it all back together again. I think it's because it's joined, isn't it? Let me just zoom out again a minute. There we go. No, nope, wrong one. I told you it was tricky. There it is. Delete that. Ta da! Right, now we're going to delete, uh, not delete, I don't want to do any more deletions. We're going to select the inner circle, outer circle and I'm just going to zoom out a bit because I'm after all that messing about I may have misaligned everything. Let me just select the whole lot and go to alignment and centre the page. Yes, I saw it shift so it did shift with all the shenanigans. Right, deselect the lattice. All we want to select We don't want, we just want the inner circle and the outer circle. Oh my goodness, it's shifted again. See, it's really tricky. Let me just zoom in a bit more to select them. Got it. Good. We want to make those into a compound path. So right click, make a compound path. Now select the whole lot. You can do that control A or select the whole lot and go back to the modified window and press weld. There you have your shape cut out of your lattice. Thank you for being so patient and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Goodbye.